Hi guys, uh, welcome back to HowMachineWorks.com. Let's learn the working of a uh, crossing type pump or an internal gear pump uh, with the help of this animation. It's also known as a charging pump. So let's go into its detail and see the working. And first, let's identify uh, each of the components. Uh, that's a suction hose, which is shown in green, and that's a discharge hose. Uh, that's our suction port, which is a part of the uh, uh, crossing pump itself. That's our discharge port over there, which is also a part of the crossing pump. Uh, that's our internal uh, gear, or uh, that's a driving gear. This particular gear gets its drive from the engine itself, and it, uh, uh, with the help of uh, that gear, the external gear also gets its drive. So this is known as the internal or the driving gear. Now that's our external gear or the driven gear. It's called as a driven gear because it's it's been driven by the internal driving gear. Both these gears are getting engaged uh, at the top over here at this section, and uh, that's how uh, they work. Uh, here they are not getting en uh, engaged because we have the crescent in between. But at the top portion, uh, the internal gear engages with the external gear, which result uh, in the transfer of the drive from the internal gear to the external gear. Okay. Further, if we see, that's our crescent, and that's a part of uh, uh, the body itself. It's not rotating. Its function is to separate the internal gear from the external gear, and also as it rotates uh, in the suction, the oil is being taken and is being uh, trapped between the gears like this. You can see the green color. The oil is getting trapped over here between the gears and the crescent, and it has been carried through these. Uh, gap between the gears and at the discharge it has been pushed outside so uh, that's the function of the crescent to separate both the gears and trap the oil between them so that the suction and the discharge can be carried out okay now let's see that's how the oil comes in and it gets trapped between both the gears as it rotates between the crescent and it's been taken away and been pushed out at the discharge so let's have another look a closer look so that's how the gears rotate and the oil gets trapped and is being given into the discharge so i believe you understand how it actually works this type of pumps are all uh, used in uh, uh, backloader machines in its transmission pump it's also called as a charging pump also so if this was useful please uh, visit our website that's how mission works.com please click over there you can reach our website or click over here to subscribe for more video updates uh, please uh, feel free to like our video or drop a comment so that uh, our team gets motivated and which help us to uh, carry on thanks for uh, watching this video have a great day